Hello. This is my floor. Um, so we're going from like 2016 to 2023. It's like 20. I started these when I was in 2016 through like 2019, and then like 2019 to 2023. And then sometimes I bounce back over here <laughs> and just like keep going. Um, okay, so one and two. I don't want to look at those. Those are ugly, old. <laughs> yeah, so we're just going to start with number three. Ooh, number three. So in number three, started this when I was 15. Maybe I should do me a little. Okay. Uh, take a shot if you see <laughs> uh, the same character drawn multiple times. So this is Lydia. I think I vividly remember drawing this. We remember drawing this on the stairs during lunchtime. I was sitting on, on the stairs and I just just started to start to sketchbook new and draw her. So that was a lot of fun. Um, the tabs are for certain characters that I keep going back to. Um, this is Rain. Anyway, <laughs> I got rid of her first concepts of another OC. He changed a lot. I have a doll of her. Let me go get her. So I later tried doll making and this is her. <laughs> She's a villain, um, and later into a doll. I don't know why I chose her, but I did, and I kind of forgot about her until now. I'm just gonna sit over there. Um, yeah, so that's crazy. Um, more concepts for a character that I was trying to rewrite. Emily, you don't really see her full potential in this one. More rain. Breezy. Breezy is part of the uh, Water Throne, and so is Galaxy, but I didn't like Galaxy design, and I kept drawing her, so I just kept adding more to her stuff. I kind of forgot about all this. I've been living on Earth for two days now. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I once had the Water Throne characters uh, live on Earth with Kate for a little bit. She's also supposed to be really comedic, and I also forgot about that. Put this back in. Okay. Um. And then there's some um, more rain, and then there's some um. Look at this intro shot. Smarter than Kazana. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> yeah. That's Osiris' first design. I know that's Claws. You can't tell who that is, but I know that's Claws. And I never finished it. There's just some blank phrases. CL, my baby, the water film characters, um, Solaris. That's one of the early characters I got rid of. That's, I think it's Adeline or Adeline. I think it's Adeline. Rainbow. And for some reason, he's straight this. Oop. CL, Rain, Moraine, uh, more CL. Oh, and Poison. A lot of Poison notes. Um, it's Poison, insane, only speaks in text. <laughs> what an Adeline? Obsessed with Lydia because she's my other half. Fingernails, covered in Poison, Poison is saliva, and kind of scared. Um, a friend drew that. Um, more claws. It took me 11 years to finally draw claws. That's so funny. The bottom here. And CL. I'm just gonna gloss over CL. Rainbow! Take a shot every time you see Rainbow in the next sketchbook. I become obsessed with her. Um, a lot more. I'm just gonna keep showing you all the, the notes. I'm not gonna let you read them. I'm just gonna show them to you. Um, I got rid of him. And that's it. <laughs> that's all there is. Let me try and move this up for you. There we go. 
And then I started only drawing on one side of the book, so that makes it useful. And that's some galaxy, Kazana, some butts. They're supposed to be in like Lydia's little series. It's supposed to be a take on like um Gwen from Can Camp and Blossom. And then I just like deleted all that from my memory. I don't know what this was. I also got rid of her. Mysterion! Flanky from Heavy Tree Friends. This is some sketches that I'll never get around to doing. Some older concepts. I don't know what I'm talking about. Me. Um, concepts, I guess. I don't know what this is. Messy. Skell Lydia. Also messy. Some more CL. I I had a vision and it did not turn out the way I thought it would, but this did. This is cute down here. Um, some Natasha. That's Kazan's mom. Luna. A bunch of eyes. And this is 2019 right here. Um. Okay. Uh, I don't know who that is. <laughs> Uh, so once some more OCs, that's Emily, that's Emily up there. I don't know who the rest of these people are. Poison, Claws. I deleted this design. I don't like it. And some more Rainbow. She's always there. My friend uh, drew this for me. Um, more CL. Some Gwen. I don't know who these people are. Some more weird concepts. With a little Kazana in there. I don't know what that was. Um, some Galaxy. I don't know. I don't really draw with references. I just make it up as I go. So a lot of this is just like messy reference sheets that never get finished. Um, which is kind of really funny. But it's good to look through. Some Adeline. I never, I never draw her face. I don't know, I keep going back to this because I forget she was supposed to have horns. And I just got rid of them. Solaris. Poison! Woo! <laughs> More poison, Lydia. And then a secret stash in here. We got a lady with a fan. We got, I think, only a lady in the fan? Okay, yeah, just one lady in the fan. Book, book four. Number four. Okay. I was 16, 2019 till no. Um. Ghost rings. Yeah. Ghost rings. I think I had my very first concept. So I had a dream about I was stuck in this blue giant Roman like cathedral house. And there were so many blue ghosts there, and I decided to write it down, and it just, just came to me after. So that was fun. And then, um, oh, then one, one another time, <laughs> I had a dream where I was stuck on a cruise ship with, like, the lizard lids from um, Magic School Bus, and these two kids were there, and this evil little ghost boy, and he stole the magic ring from me. And I'm running through the ship, and the ship starts sinking, and this little boy stole this magic ring, and all these ghosts start appearing, and I'm just, like, so scared. And eventually I get it off the ship, and, um, I'm there with the lizard <laughs> from Magic School Bus, and it just cuts, in, the, in my dream, it cuts away, sorry, it cuts away to this little ghost boy in the sinking ship holding a magical blue ring. Um, and then this one I wrote when I was five about this little story about this girl trying to escape out of her attic window with her dog. So I added her in there. <laughs> but yeah, this this is a crazy dream. Um, that little ghost boy was really angry and really evil for some reason. I don't know what he was on. But eventually all the ghost people like started dying in front of me and it was really dramatic. Anyway, <laughs> this is some 
galaxy see out and take a shot every time you see see <laughs> um and take a shot every time you see kazana that's the more shot i tried so hard on this and it did not work out i remember being really bummed and i also tried hard on this one and it did not work out yo oh some more rainbow that's rainbow i can just tell i can just tell okay rainbow <laughs> love her little boots her little boots <laughs> I'm gonna stop doing them. Sorry. I'm golden. Her design changes a lot. Old waterfront characters. Galaxy. Kate. Kate as an adult. That's a different kind of Kate. Okay, Kate as an adult. It comes a warrior. So Kate um, basically becomes a teacher and teaches Rainbow at Light Academy. She also makes her students do a ton of work for never homework. Ongoing show, okay, never mind. Her last name's actually Moom, which is a, yeah, Rainbow, I just know my favorite girl. Some Lydia, she's really messy. Some of the fan lady, she's also like a, I don't know why I have that says for Breeze. I think she's supposed to be the wind god. That's crazy. <laughs> Some rain. I I don't know what I was on, but I really decided that that was the perfect outfit. And I was just going to redraw that every time. Um, she's supposed to be the Earth God. I still think her out, her um, fit's really cute. And um, there she's some more. It's just that blossom and f uh, flaky up here for some reason. About some more water spirit concepts. See you. Oh, there's a little comic here. Okay, hold on. Let's read this. Okay, this is Kate and Breezy. Kate Breezy. Hey, oh, my bad. I'm sorry, guys. Hey Breezy, if people like wait, if people <laughs> use nicknames like you like what's <laughs> And Breezy was like, Breezy. I said, alright, so... Sieka was originally named Shadow. And then all my friends were like, like, Shadow the Hedgehog. And I was like, no. So I decided to just change his name in general. So, hey Shadow, what's your real name? Also, his real name was going to be Charlie. I also got rid of that. <laughs> Charlie. And I said, hey Breezy, what's your... Breezy. Hey, I spiked. What's your real name? Madison. <laughs> hey Breezy, what's your... Never mind. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> That's kind of funny. <laughs> and it cracks me up. Yeah. Oh, it's me. I'm the way bottom. A little self portrait moment. Oh, That's all me. Uh, trying to draw Disney princesses. And then, like, trying to draw a little monster thing up, Bob. Cute. I don't know what that is. Um, Kazana. Hold on, let me get back in the shot. Okay. Lydia, Lydia, Lydia. Lydia once had a scythe, and then her scythe became a sword. And then I just couldn't decide, because I liked the sword's design better, because the sword had, like, spiders on it, but the scythe didn't. But I think I kept the scythe, because it was creepier. So that was a lot to go through. Um, some Rhea. Back when I couldn't design it on her design, and I tried green, and I was like, oh, that's different. But then I kind of liked white because it was less effort. And then, um, she was kind of a bigger part of the story. Her name's Thorn. Hold on, there's a lot of cool notes on here. Thorn, earth clothing. <laughs> that's good, that's really funny. Also, she has tattoos. These are all tattoos. She also wears leggings. Um, what's that say? Urza's. Oh, right, because they she had beef with Liz at one point. Yeah, she wears a hood. Funny can close. Okay, so she had beef with Liz at one point. And I can't for the life of me remember why. Why does she have beef with Liz? Anyway, <laughs> some more 
rainbow. I don't know. I guess I was making notes. I make a lot of notes and all my stuff. I'm so sorry. Oh my god. I'm so sorry. Okay. I will scheme at you. Random touch that. It's so funny. Mamma mia. I, I honestly gave up a drawing hands. So I just like use like hands as like a sticks. Sorry. Hands as sticks. So that's what that is. Rainbow looks like she's getting arrested. And I was like, oh yeah, she kind of does. So then I, I hate this school. And then this is hard getting arrested. Um, <laughs> Cause I wrote that. And then I think that this is a quote from one of my friends, like, ew, I'm disturbed. And I was like, what do you mean? And then um, this is Rainbow getting arrested. I will hurt you. <laughs> I will <laughs> decapitate you. That's so funny. Yeah. It's my train of thought. I'm not gonna show that curse Kirby moment. That's a little traumatizing. Oh, dead rainbow eat the moment. Ooh, Lydia. And um, I love this one. Shout out to Liz's old design that I stuck with for like ten years. Shout out. <laughs> um, I finally changed it. I keep every time I draw her little design. But this is me trying to decide where uh, Zale, he was really a Saba, like the pony, and I was like, no, I'm gonna change it. Adeline, she's so cute. And then I tried to recreate this on this page, and it did not work out. Stay in the moon. This is old design. I love this. Let me show you a little close up. And I really like the light on this one. It's very pretty. And I like this one. Fire breath. Not as painful as everyone thinks. What does that say? Lots of... Anyway. <laughs> I think it's called Advitations. Ad, 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 advitation. Ad. No. Anyway. Um, this is Acker's like design that I was like, oh my god, the moment. This is what I stuck to. This is like, oh my god, that's so him. And then I got rid of her. She, she was somebody else. I modified the hell out of her. Is she still around? I don't know. I love how Agar looks so confused when Kazana talks to him. I feel like Kazana definitely likes Agar more than <laughs> he likes her. But then, like, he's like, you know what? I do like you a lot. She's just very forward with her love. Some rainbow. This. Okay, I made this up on the fly. Rainbow in her iconic jacket. I keep drawing her in in part two of her story. I had flower crown. It's even Lana Del Rey. Don't ever quote me on that. Oh, spoiler. I like more rainbow. Just look at the pretty pictures. Flaky. I think. Not so spoiler. That's also... Is that... You can't even read that. It's so... messy. You can't even tell who that is, but I can. Oh, look. Actually, I drew this a couple of days ago. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Why? I need to get new markers. <laughs> it's it's so much worse on camera. I think I just have really... I don't know. Because in person, it blends out better than on camera. I don't know. At least her face is fine. Okay. At least her face is fine. I just don't think I have any good markers anymore. Let's, let's pay attention to this little guy. And then Kate. I'm gonna get new markers. Cause why, why is her... Okay. And on the back. I, that's Lydia. I know my girl Lydia. I'm not supposed to be ahead. CL. I never call her anything. Uh, Breezy. Doing some wind stuff. In the winter outfits I drew I think I I think I drew this at a bar in Key West that I was forced to go to 
in the middle of summer I drew this. Nails craving some cold. Luna. But she has a little moment. She just like shoulder pads. And I think about it all the time. This was a concept for like a funny dream slash movie idea I had after watching an edit of Devilman Crybaby. Um, <laughs> some more water film characters. Some more concepts for like a fox spirit that I decided to really just run with, which is like what that fox spirit is and wanted to throw Rainbow, more rainbow. That's also a rainbow. Um, that's also a rainbow. That was supposed to be, oh my god, I just remembered who she was and I completely got rid of her. So, even, no, I think I changed his name. But rainbow had a, has a love interest who she marries. And he had a sister, and I was also going to do Inktober, and he had a sister, but I got rid of her, because she was like a villain, and supposed to be like, angsty. Oh, there she is. Candy Mana. Candy Mania. Manic. Candy Manic. <laughs> and Rainbow with her lightning powers. And then, I love this. This is the design. This, this right here is the design. It's like, Rainbow's wings. A uh, range dragon and then the moon. For the symbol of their team. I think this was a. That's actually Chaos's first designs. And I don't know who this is. I think it was supposed to be like a weird harmony thing. But that's what Chaos is. <laughs> I wanted to look nasty. He likes to grab you and then CL. Because in the final, he's supposed to like. I'm gonna block that off. Supposed to just be grabbing and kind of just like throw her around like a like a bill cipher or something and like, yeah and then you have the earth goddess and her fox um well so at one point no that was really in my bed um galaxy i never draw a galaxy ever she just shows up sometimes and chaos is free okay it's a little spoiler but look at the gears down the line so, when Chaos is free, I want everyone, the gods, to go dark, maybe Lydia, because I like the Venom. And I was like, what if Lydia gets taken over <laughs> by Venom? And then, Rain's supposed to be like the storm goddess, like dark blue, gray, icy tights, purple dark s skirt thing. I said, this is also Twisted by Miso, it was like the song, in black beads. And then Luna was supposed to be like a messy hair, big dress, flowing crescent moon on her hair. And then I had the hair idea where like her hair would be like split, like blonde and black. Because originally her hair was just black. And then I was like, no, her hair should literally go from blonde to black, like waning and waxing of the moon and would just change all the time in the episode to show like progress of time her hair would just like change its color it goes like blonde across i thought that was like the smartest thing i ever thought of in my entire life i also gave her space moon buns based off sailor moon later because i thought that was the smartest idea i don't know what that is and then this is me trying backgrounds for the first time blank page Ske secret envelope it's in here oh my god there's actually things in here this time okay I love this so much. This is so good. I love this. Some breezy. Nothing on the back. Is there anything on the back in here? No. I think I just had a green pen and a purple pen and I tried to draw everybody who was purple. Except for Rainbow. You don't know why I know that's Rainbow, but I just do, okay? A mother never forgets her child. But that's you. Because it's obvious because of the hair thing. I, that's an old concept character named Rose. That's Kate. I just know another of my babies. That's Gwen. That's also Gwen. I don't know why I know that's Rainbow. I just do. And what's this? Oh, this is everyone's old, old ages. Very old ages. That get changed. Yeah, she's not that age anymore. She's also not that age anymore. She's also not that age anymore. 
Also, no. No. Well, I aged her down to 15. Who is that? Poisoned, also a question mark. Yeah, so the vision I was gonna have everyone like a hundred years old. Hey, I decided against it. Big sketchbook time. Woo! Okay. I keep hitting that. I'm so sorry. Giant sketchbook time. Let me zoom out. Okay, there we go. There we go. Javal backgrounds color question mark. Okay. This this sketchbook is so messy. It's kind of iconic how messy it is. That's Liz, by the way. I tried to do something here. It did not go well. And her old designs look so cute. So it's going to be so messy. Get ready for that. Um, <laughs> don't know what this is. That's Ruth. That's some designs for me trying to figure out how to build um, the Water Thrones, like, castle in Senda. Is that different else? I I made it up. Um, and then I tried to build it in Minecraft, and then I didn't like it in Minecraft, it was too big. But anyway, um, ooh, this is the game's outfits for Ecker, for some reason. All back trench coat, no, mirrors, glasses, come and go, all the time. Some... I'm not, no, I'm not gonna tell that story. Never mind. <laughs> I'm not gonna tell the story today. Um, red, so each, like, so there's like, I think there's nine, or maybe there's twelve. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten different powers, and they each would have their own different color. In order to tell, like, who's who on the battlefield for the games. Who to cheer for, you know? Old concepts, I don't know. I've tried to do like this gender bend, um, Demon Slayer Fire Guy. I always forget his name. This is pretty cool. It was pretty cool. Apparently I only had orange and red on hand. Cause I didn't color anything on. And then, this is me trying to get rid of some characters. You can say who stayed and who didn't. She stayed. Dead. Luna Rain. She's still alive, I think. Galaxy dead. Adeline, Aurora, Nuri dead. Wait, is that? Oh. I guess she's still alive. I just never think about her, damn. She almost died today. <laughs> that was awful. And then I said, I can't get rid of this one character, and then I did. It's so funny. Um, and then everyone's heights, if you want to look at that. And then, <laughs> little moment, and then I was like, you know what would be great if I said, hey, these two are best friends now. Um, said, hey, these two are best friends now. Um, and then another, that's Rainbow, because I wrote RD. Like, Rainbow should do a pull of Urza from Fairy Tale and just like show up in different outfits all the time. Because that'll be cool. And then, um, the missions, the school. Wait, what does that say? Let's read this together. Anyone can do Urza weapons. That's a cool concept, but I'm not probably not. The missions, the school copies is either fineness or training. Oh! Supplies. That says supplies. My bad, guys. The mission to school supplies is either find this magical object or do some training. The level of importance, and then I have like. Oh, so okay, so God slash like rainbow because she's not technically not a god, and then guardians, um, and then knights, which is what Azra is, because Gwen would technically be a knight. She's like knighted and stuff, which is what she does later, which is why she's involved with Lydia. And then Breezy would technically just be a warrior, and then civilian and warrior in training, basically. Um, yeah. And then... I don't know what that is. Um, this is a map. I know, it's a lot to take in. It surprised me too. I think... I have no idea where this is, but it's definitely a place. <laughs> it's definitely a place! Um, that's Rambo. 
That's also rainbow. That's also rainbow. That's not rainbow. Get it straight. <laughs> you think three? Um, okay, let's, let's take a look at this one. What does this one say? Okay, so this is a white glove and cape, and she looks like a red jacket, and then she's supposed to go to the Arctic, and she's like, I understand my powers now. Like a little Elsa moment. This is another map. And then more rainbow. Maybe in her jacket. And more rainbow in this like crystal dress thing with Bob. More. Another map. I didn't color. Um, that's... What's his goddamn name? Ethan. Aether. Whatever the hell his name is. That's Rainbow's Lovins. That's Rainbow. That's not Rainbow. That's Icy. And that's somebody else. <laughs> I don't remember. Okay. Rainbow Part 2, where we start to get into some new villains for Rainbow and Rain and Luna meeting up and the worlds colliding. So we have basically Bill slash like, Bill Cypher slash like Discord villain, where he was like the sloth demon who could go into people's dreams. Um, dies by Charlie setting him on fire and burning down the house while he's asleep. That's so funny. Also, she took one of his eyes. Y'all reading this? She took one of his eyes. Damn. And then I have a succubus, because what kind of demon is in the succubus? Also, oh, spoiler. She's Candy Mania's sister. Um, dies by Luna's bow. Not shot. She's just stabbed into the heart, but not shot. Like, not an arrow. And then, why do, and then I was like, watch Husband Hotel, because that happened. And I was like, oh my god. What if we had, like... Because I love the evil Charlie idea. I loved it. I loved every moment of it. I was like, oh my god, evil Charlie, that's such a good idea. And then I grabbed hold of that, and I was like, let me just get rid of her entire personality and add my own twist to everything. And then I just decided, no, I just really like the inspiration. Um, and then a horse. Because I was watching... I don't know what I was watching. And then I don't know what that is. Oh! And then I have the original, um, uh, kind of immortal entities for the Water Throne. And then I have Love Craze. That's her name, by the way. That's the Succubus's name. Love Craze. Um, she technically. I'm not gonna go into her whole lore or backstory today, but, um, I keep drawing her. Because she's really pretty to me. And, um, yeah. And then we have a character, words, not drawings. That's Rainbow. That's also Rainbow. <laughs> I just know it's her. Because, um, I think it's because all the lines in the hair symbolize her different colors. And then some notes over here that says... Charlie's 1920s outfit, Blossom and Gwen as Scooby-Doo with <laughs> Lydia. When gone with purple hair. Okay. When gone with purple hair, Lydia. Lydia, Gwen, and Blossom. And then games. Whoops. Games, people. My bad, guys. And then I was like, okay, these girls need sleepover outfits. Let's get them some sleepover outfits. Is this 2020? I don't know what this is. I think he's just sad. Oh, wait, hold on. Okay, that's a hand and a face. I don't know if you can see it now and he's, he's upset. Okay, I definitely copied that off Pinterest. I definitely did that off Pinterest. Jail. Um, oh, this is new design. Mira's hair. Okay, I actually, wait, I drew that yesterday. I, yeah, I drew this yesterday. My bad. <laughs> um, oh, I guess we're turning my, f okay. I also went into this, yeah, I went back into this, and my friend drew, um, I didn't draw, she gave me, or they gave me a, um, plushie. It's on my little shelf. And then I watched Care Bears while doing that, so that's a Care that's a carrot. That's poison, by the way. And then I was like, okay, I need poison to be upside down, kicking their little feet up while being weird. And then I was like, how do I do that? And that's what that is. And then this is some designs for Light Academy. Um, 
this is, um, I don't know what that is. And then it's Alice. And then, um, and I never finished some of these sketches. Hmm. And then I was like, you know what? Galaxy needs to look like an actual empress, so let's just put more bling on her. NCL's also there. Fire Lady. These are. I don't know. This is definitely from Pinterest, but yeah. Mira. And I was like, Mira needs some new clothes. Icy, because she needs to look more like she's actually cold and different from everybody else. So I gave her these weird hair bubble things that were like really trendy at the time. So, also changed name to Victoria Beth, because I want to. Yeah. I will. And then, oh, and then I have like, what's in all these buildings? And then I have, um,. Ariella is like Victorian, and then also Victorian, but goth Victorian, and then, yeah, there's a bunch of stuff like that. And then I have, what if they went to the club era moment, and then, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, I never draw the sisters together. So here they are. Um, we both are crazy, because they both worked for Claws, basically, but... We only hear from Candy because she died because she was like working all the time. And she died because she died. I don't know. And then technically they're, they're, these girls are part human. They're half human. So one parent's human, which is why like they have, their powers are a bit unstable, but they like look human. Which is why I, this is just like me, like, trying to reason with myself why I didn't give them ears or a tail. They're not normal Vonicans. Um, is this Tigri Merler Hot Couture Fall Winter 1998? I really like this one. I did, I do this at my cousin's house. I love this hair. I oh, also love her hair and her fire breathing stuff. Emily from Ghost Ring Stuff. Why do I always look like that? <laughs> and then my teacher gave us an assignment for um, theater costuming, and it was like draw. And I like I picked Alice in Wonderland because I always always think about Alice in Wonderland all the time. It's like draw some Alice in Wonderland stuff. So while we're here, let's fly right through this. A Queen of Hearts, Alice, Mad Hatter, Cheshire Cat, the Bunny. Okay, <laughs> that's it, guys. Um, Rainbow, I just, no, it's her. <laughs> um. <laughs> I don't know who that is. Who has piercings? Rainbow has piercings. But it's not Rainbow. Her, their hair is different. Who has piercings? I have no idea, but I know that's me trying to draw a pose for poison. I have no idea what that is. I'm sorry. Anyway, I'm not going to talk about that one. Oh, uh, Rainbow Dash. Uh, I got bored. It's just 2020, so I'm in COVID. So I just started drawing Rainbow Dash. And then something else. And then Lydia, oh my god. I love this outfit so much. Oh my god. Sometimes I like to imagine if I, so I like to imagine that like it's October, I'm at like Megacon and I'm wearing this, I'm wearing this with this little hat and this little thing and I walk onto stage and like Thriller by Michael Jackson starts playing <laughs> and I walk onto stage and there's like a little promo, like a little video thing they have at like Megacon or like um, Comic Con or like a little spider just like moving right and i'm wearing this and i come out and like thriller's playing and they're like oh my god she's an icon and i'm just like haha i'm referencing lydia yeah some good stuff um love craze let's look at these notes fight 
Love doesn't have horns or tail. I think all demons didn't have horns, but Charlie and then Guardians. So old stuff. Um, the Guardians actually got deleted. That little story part gone. Poof. Then some little funny girl. Is that it? Okay. And then I was like, how tall are these girls? How tall are they? Also, Poison's not a girl. Um, my bad. <laughs> I did not. Uh, Poison wouldn't, would find it funny if people thought they were a girl, but they're not. They're also not a boy. Poison doesn't have a gender. Just keep that in mind, please. Um, but I don't really care <laughs> either way. Um, okay. Oh, my baby Kazana. This is Rainbow Dash, but as a human, I think. Um, did I wrote RD. Sometimes I write RD, but it also says Rainbow Dash there. So. Charlie, Love Craze. I never draw Charlie because I never like how Charlie looks. And then the 1920 outfit, because I kept listening to Will I Am, like Bang Bang. And I was like, that's such a good song for them. Um, then I got really angry and I tore out a page. But don't worry, it'll just be messy. And then I ripped the page. And then <laughs> it was a rip the air. Yeah. And then we had my greatest work of art that I did in my bed. Do you can see how angry I got that I went through the page onto another page? Yeah, so then I decided to have a little storyboard moment and um, have Breezy and Kate just walk around. And then I had another moment. You can see how, oh, yeah, it goes through this page too. There's also a rip in this page. What pissed me off? I have no idea. I also almost ripped out this page. This is such a good page. I love this page. So this is where Rhea died. Yeah, and this is where, uh, I, her name later is, um, Griselda. This is where Griselda breaks her back. <laughs> I live, I name is, I rename, <laughs> I rename Gis, uh, Claude to Griselda, so let's just take a look at this. Um, this is supposed to be, like, episode two or three or something. So, the portal, so the portal closes while the, um, Waterdome gang leaves. And we was like, bye guys. And then Ruth appears and she's like, and goes over here. And we was like, who are you? And Ruth is like, claws, attack. So then she attacks. And then, um, and then Rhea's like, no. And then grabs claws, throws them against a tree. The tree breaks because of how hard the impact was. And then Ruth is like, what is she like? Oh, she's like, no, no, it's my turn. So. Ruth then decides, I think Poison's also supposed to be there or something. No. No, Poison's not supposed to be there. And then Rhea's supposed to fight um, Ruth. And they fight a little bit. And then Ruth throws Rhea against the tree. And Ruth's like, Rhea's like, ow! And then Ruth, get, <laughs> Ruth grabs Rhea's hair and is like, I'm gonna kill you now. And she's like, oh no. And she dies. And that's that. Next page. Uh, <laughs> and then just some notes for a project on the brain. And my teacher's like, why don't you draw different functions of the brain as different creatures? And I'm not going to do that. I'm sorry. I'm not going to do that. Anyway, Alice. She's a guardian. She's also inspired like the Alice in Wonderland movie. Because I love her. And then Poison. I'm sorry, I'm just gonna skip over that. I'm just gonna skip over that. <laughs> and then, for some ungodly reason, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't think, but I, I, but I knew better, and I put the lines all purple inside her hair, but I knew better than to draw her hair. Why? I don't know. And then, okay, the ghost rings. Um, the look 
look at Abigail. That's their dead mom. <laughs> That's what Pegasus, like, ideas are. And then it's supposed to be a little ghost around. That's Emily. I love this outfit of Emily. Every, the art style for the twins keeps changing all the time. Because I cannot decide how I want to draw them. A blank page. Love that for me. Um, some more Liz. Because I think her hairstyle is so iconic. It still is. And then I have a height chart. The height chart. And then some drawings of the people in their winter outfits, but colored this time. And then a dog. And then a little chibi art. Um, this Acker finding out that Kazan is a princess. Um, some horses. I don't know if you know what a horse looks like. Um, a bench for some reason. Another stool for some reason. Um, the same project from earlier just moved on. Don't know what that is. That's kind of scary. Queen of Hearts. Ooh, my Halloween costume. Fun. Um, Rainbow. That's not her husband. That's her son. I know that because I remember his design like the back of my hand. He's supposed to take Luna's little shoulder pads but just have like one or something. That's both Rainbow and that's Luna. Uh, Ice Face. Um, some of the winter outfits again. You can tell I'm just like really unmotivated sometimes. Where I just like give up on trying everything. And it's like, okay, and just move on. Um, feet and hands. Don't look at that. <laughs> I was really depressed, guys. Okay, so this is when everybody dies in Rainbow. And she's like, um, I'm so sad. So in God, Rainbow gets more depressed as her mother's powers get stronger in her. Because her mom's... You know, I'm not going to say whose mom is. I can keep a secret. All eyes are... I think this is a song. All eyes are on you. What's she going to do? Is that a song? Maybe. I don't know. So Rainbow, so I watched like, um, what did I watch? I watched an anime where they had like these crazy colorful eyes just like up here. And I was like, oh my god, that's so cool. So what if like Rainbow's like weird hypnotic dream powers start coming to her like she can't control them because her mind's all over the place. And the more she loses her sanity, the more like the dream powers get stronger. So, I thought, hey, what if, like, her thoughts and whatnot and her, like, issues start disappearing as these weird eyes? And she's like, I don't, like, I know they're not real, but they kind of are because she's making them. Don't look at that. Um, <laughs> Liz. And then I'm, oh, we're almost done. And then I have some more sketches. Some Alice in Wonderland poster sketches because now our, my teacher said, Hey, you designed all these characters, now make a poster for it. So that was that. I don't look at that. Um, and then, like, make a ticket for it. Don't look at that. And then the Ghost Ring's final villain. Oh, don't look at that. Um, <laughs> and then, um,. Some ghost ring characters. You can look at that. That's fine. That's Sonic. <laughs> no words. And then we're almost done. We're almost done. Swear to God, we're almost done. Swear to God, swear to God, swear to God, swear to God. Okay, Liz. People. And that's it. Oh my god, we got through that. Oh my god, that was awful. Awful. Okay. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I hope you had fun watching me ramble. Um, this made me remember a lot of stuff I forgot that I wrote down. <laughs> um, a lot of the stuff is the same, except there's also like kind of not. That doesn't make any sense. But I'm gonna keep a lot of the same concepts. The characters are still gonna be there. Just some of the same like events are changing. Like, Alice is now, if the Water Thorn ever gets to season two, which it, I'm sorry, but it probably won't, because I have 
I have to write, I'm, I'm making the water throne and then jumping right into Rainbow. And if season two, if, if season two happens of the water throne, I'm, I, I don't think, uh, oh, dude, Alice would be there, like, the, like, baby Alice, like a nine-year-old Alice, guardian Alice, my Alice, would show up, um, and she would, like, tell Kazana what it would be like to be a guardian, and that will be, like, our first official introduction to a guardian, and then, um, and then we'll know who Alice is, but Alice also finally comes back with, um, in Rainbow, because Alice is also alive when Gris attacks, so Alice is there during that, and I kind of just want Alice to appear during this and pivotal timeline point for her to be dead later <laughs> and then come back as a helper to CL spoiler I guess my bad um cause that's very important for her to just come back and help CL and I know I kind of didn't jump into the water throne get everyone introduced to the world I created and just took off and take off from there and they were going to meet Rainbow and then get really really sad as I traumatize some people by making her sad and then bend your arm and then um and then untraumatize everybody and then <laughs> and maybe I would have Emily cause Emily was supposed to show up during have her own little story but it's supposed to be like a little mini series or basically in flashbacks sort of and then um and then Lydia shows up. Lydia's also supposed to show up in Gods, so... A lot happens in Gods, apparently. Why did I say apparently? I'm the creator and author. But I'm also not. This stuff kind of just comes to me. And I'm like, boom, story! Um, gotta write that down. Gotta draw that now. Oh my god. I'm so old. <laughs> She's so scary looking, but it really fits. Uh, um, <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to animate, and I wrote the script for episode one, and I have like a giant story, and I have a giant like um, Google Slides of episode one. Episode one is like basically done, um, and I have like the full thing, like the full water throne. As like a Google slide presentation, so I'm gonna make a video about that. I have a Pinterest board. I don't want. But I'll, I'll make a video showing you my Pinterest board. Secrets are in that Pinterest board. Okay, I said enough. I'm starting to ramble. Bye.